a South Texas tradition since 1964. This is KIII TV3's Domingo Live. Hola, ¿qué tal? Y bienvenidos. Welcome to La Tradición del Sur de Texas from the sparkling city by the sea as we take a look at our Texas State Aquarium and the Harbor Bridge. Hermosa ciudad, right? Perfect. What a wonderful place that we live in. Hermosísimo el día so far. What a beautiful day. Thank you so much for joining us on this Sunday. This Sunday, we have a special treat for you. Yes, we do. We have live music with... Michael Salgado. That's right. So, yes. <laughs> and, and, and we also have a little live audience with us this morning. Yes, so we're getting there. We're getting there. Yes, we have been talking for a long period of time. We've been trying to get live, ba live bands back on the show. Uh, we've had Lucky Joe. We've had Ray Ray. We had Sarah Monique. We're starting to get them in. And now we've got Michael Salgado. So exactly. if you're a live band out there um, and you've been on the show before, or if you know you haven't, uh, make sure that you reach out to us on our Domingo Live Facebook page, or you can email us as well, exactly. Domingo Live at KHBLITV.com. Send in your information and yeah. we'll get a hold of you. As a matter of fact, uh, during the show, vamos a poner la información en la pantalla so you can look at it, you can get the information down. If you have a band, it doesn't have to be just Tejano, mm -hmm. it can be regional Mexican, it can be anything that represents nuestra cultura aquí in South Texas. Le vamos a mandar información so that you can look at it, so that that way you can send us your videos, your audios, your music, and a little bit of biography de, de yeah. tu grupo, verdad, para que se presenten aquí en Domingo Live, because we want to get all of our local bands, yes. local bands, También. and people from throughout the state of Texas as well that want to come in and perform mm -hmm. cuando tengamos el tiempo That's so we right. can schedule it. So We cannot wait mm -hmm. to have you. Exactly. That's so right. tenemos un show, I mean, completely full of great, first of all, music and wonderful guests that are going to give some great information of events that are happening here in South Texas. For example, the Art Gala is coming mm -hmm. up. We're También gonna Cultura Hispánica Internacional Dinner, and we're going to talk to you about that. We also have Gabe Canales, mm -hmm. the Blue Cure founder. It's, talk, it's time to talk about men's health exactly. and how you, all you men out there can take care of yourself. It's Absolutely. very important. Absolutely. And of course, we have so much more information that's going to be happening, including our new segment and the weather for the rest of the week, all coming up here on the Mingo Live. So, vamos a iniciar la programación. You want music? We've got music. There Michael you go. Salgado, right here on the Mingo Live. Con mil botellas que me ayuda 
van a olvidar y yo le ruego al Señor por su regreso que hace falta el fuego que pagó su adiós tal vez si vuelve a brindarme su cariño al corazón que triste vive sin su amor Mrs. Baird's is teaming up with local food banks to fight Texas hunger by donating thousands of loaves this June, and we need your help donating too. Look for displays at area grocery stores and scan the QR code to make a donation to your local food bank. Together, we can make a difference in fighting Texas hunger. Is it time to upgrade your window treatments? Call Academy Window Coverings. We are a local family-owned company with over 50 years of quality experience. We carry brands such as Hunter Douglas, Graber, Norman, and many more. We also provide the latest in quality exterior hurricane shutters, Bahama shutters, colonials, roll-ups, exterior louver blinds, and security hurricane screens. For a perfect fit, visit our fabulous showroom or call Academy Window Coverings today for a free in-home consultation. Yeah, dude, that doesn't look good. I know what to do. I'm going to castnetusa.com. I can apply minutes, and if approved, I can have the money as soon as the same business day. Go to castnetusa.com to apply for the money you need. Texas Monthly just named Thomas J. Henry one of the most influential Texas business icons in the last 50 years, with five offices across the state, 30 years of service, 300 attorneys, 5,000 client reviews. Results that speak for themselves. Thomas J. Henry. The name you know, the firm you trust. Hunger Root is here. I'm gonna open the box. And my refrigerator is packed. Guitars and amps. Vibration. Drums and keyboards. Vibration. Sound systems. Vibration. Lighting equipment. DJ and recording gear. In-house repair service. Lady Ray and financing. Gift cards. Open Sundays. Is your Generac Home Standby Generator ready for a power emergency? Are you overdue for annual maintenance? Schedule a multi-point inspection today with Generator Supercenter. Factory certified technicians are standing by to ensure your Generac Generator is ready when you need it most. Call today. Buenos días, feliz domingo. Les saluda Barbie Leo con su breve informativo de la semana. Solo semanas después de que las protecciones de la era de la pandemia vencieron, cientos de miles de americanos se encuentran que pueden estar sin cobertura de Medicaid. Al menos 19 estados han comenzado a retirar las personas de sus rollos de Medicaid en un proceso conocido como desenrollamiento. Ha llevado a la confusión a las familias que se quedan sin cobertura y sin aviso en muchos casos. Los datos muestran más de 500 mil americanos no tienen cobertura hasta el momento. Y los estados tienen la obligación federal de enviar aviso a los destinarios informándoles de los próximos cambios. Una nueva tendencia de rendición de cuentas se extiende a lo largo de los Estados Unidos. Cada vez más centros comerciales, parques de diversión y otros lugares públicos están creando nuevas políticas dirigidas a los adolescentes justo antes del verano. Y muchos requieren que los menores estén acompañados por un adulto. Hay varias reglas, pero las políticas tienden a objetivos en momentos específicos del día. Y la tendencia se está extendiendo a medida que más negocios andan experimentando un aumento en el comportamiento de los adolescentes alborotadores. Y un gato y algunos perritos se adueñaron de la pasarela en la Pet Gala, la ciudad de Nueva York. El evento de este año presentó a un gato que se vistió como la artista Dojo Cat de la Gala del Met y el evento destacó la importancia del rescate de animales y los perritos también fueron disfrutando como a Salma Hayek. Bad Bunny y P. Diddy. 
Qué lindos, ¿verdad? Y con eso terminamos su breve informativo de la semana. Muchísimas gracias por, su, por acompañarnos y ahora su pronóstico del tiempo. Howdy there, Coastal Ben. Good Sunday to everyone. We have temperatures in the middle 80s this afternoon, working our way up to about 90 degrees by this afternoon. We've got partly cloudy skies, though a rain chance working into the forecast heading into later this afternoon and into the early evening. We're going to be watching to our north for some showers to work their way into the coastal bend. We stay dry for most of the rest of the night into Monday morning, 71 for our low with a mix of clear skies and clouds, so a very similar morning morning to today heading into tomorrow afternoon. We're going to start to see more clouds and rain chances. Same thing for Tuesday, so that's going to translate to some lower high temperatures, though you can see we're going to already start the morning on Tuesday a little more active with some scattered activity around the coastal bed. Now the reason we have all of that activity the next couple of days is thanks to weather on the west coast. This high and low pressure is having the subtropical jet stream bring pieces of energy into the coastal bend. So this is acting like a little highway for all those pieces of energy that combines with all the moisture and the daily sea breeze to give us those shower chances. As the high pressure scoots further uh, to us or closer to us, I should say, that's going to bring less and less of that energy as well as eventually drier air and warmer temperatures. Though here at the surface, we are still going to be plenty humid. So when you combine the hot afternoon temperatures with the humidity, it's going to feel even hotter. Now we've seen high around 90 for some time as well as uh, feels like temperatures in the mid 90s. But what we haven't seen consistently are highs in the middle and upper 90s here in the coastal bend and adding 10 degrees on top of that to those feels like temperatures. It's going to be very hot here in the coastal bend, so make sure you're practicing your heat safety into this coming weekend. 90 for our high today, a couple places higher than that. But again, keep in mind that heat safety the heat index is going to be really toasty heading into next weekend. All right, Kristen. Thank you, Mala. Kristen. Thank and you. you'll be able to see Kristen and her entire weather team tonight on our hurricane special que sale a las 6 de la noche o las 6 right. de la tarde hoy aquí en el That's canal 3. Right. Also want to talk to you about the hurricane kits. If you are interested para participar en los hurricane kits para que le pasen uno, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. A ver si se ganan uno, tienen que entrar este durante la mañana, ver las noticias con Barbie, of course, and, and JTK. Manding su información a aquella estación, and maybe you will be one of the winners of one of our uh, hurricane kits. They have a lot of information, a lot of good material in there that you could win this time around. Uh, and keep our fingers crossed que nada pase este, That's right. este verano, ¿verdad? This, this summer, um, invierno, right? But just in case we have you covered. Yeah. ¿verdad? Yeah, exactly. And of course, the hurricane premiere airing tonight at 6 o'clock. All the information that you need to know to be prepared. So, tenemos más música. Michael Salgado, right here on Domingo Live.
cohete para ahogar las penas de mi corazón. Porque ya no aguanto tanto sufrimiento que me está causando esta decepción. Para mí que la inquieta me tiene embrujado, por eso estoy loco, por ella de amor, por eso la busco, la sigo y le ruego, y hasta le he llorado palabra de What should we do? I'm going to CashNetUSA.com. I can apply in minutes, and if approved, we can have the money as soon as the same business day. Go to CashNetUSA.com to apply for the money you need. Drain problems? One of the bigger pains for any homeowner to deal with. I am Bobby Jenkins. With clogged or slow drains, you may not know where or what the problem is. Is it just below the sink or 10 feet down the line? Is it caused by grease, hair, a toy, or even roots in your main sewer? With ABC's $99 drain cleaning, it doesn't matter. Our licensed drain experts can find it and remove it. Simple and for one flat price. The process is designed for your convenience. One price, one call. Call ABC today. Historically, growth has taken place in a non-strategic manner that has not been planned. And as a result, new growth has put a strain on existing city facilities and infrastructure. New water and wastewater infrastructure for commercial and residential developments has primarily been funded by trust funds since 1982. Roadway and stormwater improvements needed to support new developments are currently funded by the ratepayer. So we're creating master plans to assure that responsible growth happens more intentionally, therefore exploring funding alternatives to support the infrastructure necessary for this growth. is here. I'm gonna open the box and my refrigerator is packed. Familias. Las familias necesitan espacio. De aquí al carapulpo es mi lado. Las familias necesitan compartirlo todo. Las familias necesitan Una familia de SUVs para lo que sea que necesite tu familia. Ven a ver la gran equipo de Volkswagen de Corpus Christi. Pase y amor, mis amigos. Welcome back to Domingo Live. In this segment, we're talking to a dear friend of Domingo Live, a personal friend of ours yes. as well. Um, Sister Milagros is with us right here, right now. Bienvenida. Gracias. Mucho gusto en tener aquí con nosotros. Muchas gracias por darme la oportunidad. Vamos a platicar de the ARC Gala, que ha estado en ausencia por más de tres años por la pandemia. Exactamente. Vamos a regresar este año con mucha fuerza. Con mucha fuerza y con mucha ilusión. Sí y con empeño, porque todo lo que hagamos va a ser para hacer la diferencia en la vida de un niño. Entonces, por eso merece la pena. Va a ser en septiembre 21, y va a ser en Richie Borcher Fairground, y yo quiero aprovechar esta oportunidad para invitar a las personas que nos quieran acompañar ese día, o compañías, agencias, porque creo que ya estamos listos para volver otra vez a estar en público, y más cuando es por una causa como esta, que va a ser para ayudar a los niños. O yo les invito a que nos llamen lo antes posible para que una vez más podamos decir que ha sido un éxito. Eh, otra cosa que vamos a tener muy especial este año es que tú vas a ser el maestro de ceremonias. Gracias. Y para nosotros es otro honor, porque pues yo son muchos los años que te conozco, Ruth. Desde cuando éramos jóvenes. Sí, cuando estábamos Muchísimos jóvenes años. y veíamos cómo es. Cuando éramos jóvenes. Yo me conocía cuando estaba flaquito. No, sí. no, todavía está flaquito. Sí. Estos milagros para los participantes y para los invitados que quieran ir. Eh, ¿Qué se pueden esperar en este evento? 
Bueno, va a ser, ¿en qué consiste? Sí, cuéntame. Va a consistir en una cena, uh -huh. vamos a tener una subasta en vivo y una subasta de esta en silencio que escribes tú lo que quieres poner uh, para conseguir el regalo que quieres y este vamos a tener una oradora famosa parece y que ha sufrido ella en ella misma uh -huh. las consecuencias de un abuso ella viene desde alemania voy a leerlo porque no sé pronunciarlo sí, bien okay. se llama Gwen van de paz okay. y viene desde alemania si dios quiere y también ella tiene mucho interés y en ayudar a las familias a que haya menos abusos para la gente que no sepa de The Ark, ¿qué hacen ahí? Ya sé que nos, nosotros hemos reportado últimas veces eh, en lo que hace The Ark, pero hay mucha gente que no sabe. Sí, mira, el, el arca, mucha gente cree que es una guardería o que es un orfanatorio. No, no es. Es un refugio para niños afugiados. Cuando hablamos de niños abusados, este, lo primero que se nos viene a la mente a la mayoría de la gente es abuso sexual. Que sí tenemos algunos casos, pero es más negligencia o físico. Cuando digo físico, que golpean a un niño, un bebito de dos meses, tres meses, que viene con la pelvis quebrada o con una piernita quebrada o con una mano, cosas así. No creo yo que los que hacen esto son malas personas. Lo que pasa es que los principios, los valores, los tenemos confundidos. Y esto es por las drogas, por el alcohol, que no les dejan pensar bien pero la criatura es la que paga las consecuencias. Y son los que no se pueden defender ellos mismos. Exactamente. Especialmente porque pues la edad y son niños, entonces es, yo digo que es eh, la responsabilidad de la comunidad que ayude a nuestros niños. Sí, y por qué es importante que el niño crezca en un ambiente sano, en un ambiente con valores y que el niño pueda disfrutar de la vida de ser un niño. Sabemos que en años anteriores Uh, ha habido muchos sponsors que han participado en la gala cada año. Ahora queremos invitar a todos ellos que regresen. Que este regresen año. y que nos ayuden otra vez más. Sí, Sería sí. buenísimo que pudiéramos este, cubrir todos los gastos con donaciones para que así todo Penny que entrara en esa fiesta fuera para directamente ayudar al niño. Y también todos los invitados, ya me dijo Sister Milagros que la comida va a estar bendecida para que sea fat free. Ah, sí. <risa> sí. <risa> ya se había oído, ¿no? Así sí, que va a ser. Lo hará sí. nuestro señor That's obispo, right. Michael Malby. <risa> Platíquenos una vez más los, los datos, cuándo se va a llevar a cabo, dónde y dónde, nos, dónde podemos comprar los, los boletos. Y bueno, los boletos nos podéis llamar por teléfono para hacer las gestiones necesarias. El lugar va a ser el Fairground, aquí en, allí en Rostán, y luego también la fecha es el 21 de septiembre, que okay, comienza a las 6 de la tarde con la subasta en silencio. Y luego a continuación, este, cuando el maestro de ceremonias, Mr. Rudy Treviño, <risa> nos abra la función, entonces sí. este, ya comienza con la cena y tenemos también la subasta uh, al vivo, que son unas un poquitas uh, cosas. Sí, es que milagro, sí. siempre un placer tenerla aquí Gracias. con nosotros. Yo también. Este, quería pedirte, si es posible, decirle a la comunidad también que estamos en necesidad de conseguir trabajadores buenos, con Para valores. Bien. Necesitamos dos buenas cocineras o cocineros. Cuando sí. digo cocineros, puede ser hombre como puede ser mujer. Personas con valores, porque es difícil trabajar en un sitio así donde los niños están sufriendo y tú les vas a dar cariño y apoyo, y eso es a través de la comida, a través de tu servicio. Sí. Ok, so, necesitamos trabajadores en el día, tra trabajadores en la noche y cocineras. Okay. Bueno. Right. Y nomás tienen que llamarle allí a su. Sí, que a, llamen al número de teléfono que supongo que lo podéis poner en la pantalla. Ok, sister, thank you. Gracias. Yeah. gracias. Y una vez okay. más, gracias por darme la oportunidad y gracias al público por escuchar. Claro no, no. que sí. Ahora continuamos con más música y en esta ocasión, este, Michael uh, is, is doing something super nice mm -hmm. for all of us here in South Texas ahorita. Este, su grabación con mariachi. That's right. Merece un mariachi. That's right. So we've got a mariachi in the house as well. Um, a local mariachi, mariachi celestial, along with Michael Salgado right here on Domingo Live. Por presumir a mis amigos les conté 
triste que en el amor ninguna pena ni aniquila que para probarles de tus besos me olvidé y me bastaron unos tragos de tequila les platiqué que me encontré con otro amor y que en sus brazos fui dejando de quererte que te aborrezco desde el día de tu traición y que en momentos que he deseado hasta tu muerte acá Quiero que sepas la verdad No te ha dejado de adorar Hay en mi triste soledad Me han dado ganas de gritar Salir corriendo y preguntar ¿Qué es lo que ha sido de tu vida? Acá Siempre te voy a recordar Y hoy que a mi lado ya no estás No queda más que confesar Que ya no puedo soportar Que estoy odiando sin odiar Porque respiro por la ¿Cómo me duele? Acá entre nos Quiero que sepas la verdad No te ha dejado de adorar Ay, en mi triste soledad me han dado ganas de gritar, salir corriendo y preguntar qué es lo que ha sido de tu vida. Acá entre nos siempre te voy a recordar. Yo que a mi lado no queda más que confesar que ya no puedo soportar que estoy odiando sin odiar porque respiro por la herida. Is your credit score getting in the way of the things you want to do? Personal loans through NetCredit offer fast and flexible lending. Borrow up to $10,000 and choose repayment terms that work for you. You may even be able to build your credit history as you repay. NetCredit, a more personal, personal loan. At School of Science and Technology Corpus Christi, we've reimagined education with a student-focused and STEM-based curriculum. Our pre-K through 12 students are provided resources and dedicated staff support that attributes to 100% high school graduation rate and a college acceptance of 100%. The early elementary campus at 3601 Saratoga is the newest of four locations. We are accepting applications at our tuition-free campuses. Choose excellence at SST, an A-rated district. In 2020 alone, there were nearly 150,000 crashes involving large trucks and buses in the U.S. Accidents with 18-wheelers can be catastrophic for drivers. If you were injured in an 18-wheeler accident, call Thomas J. Henry. Thomas J. Henry handles serious trucking cases and gets serious results for injured clients. Call today. Thomas J. Henry is available 24-7, nights and weekends. I've been a member of 
Coast Light Credit Union since January 2nd of 2019. They taught me about interest, keeping a financial goal and sticking with it. When my son walks in, he, you know, they're, they're smiling, they're greeting him, even calling him by name, and he gets excited about that. They don't want to just be a financial institution, but they really desire to be a family. In the morning when I rise, I know I've got you on my side. You're good for me, so naturally. And I can't wait for that fresh taste of richness you bring. I like the way you make me feel. Yeah. Highland Dairy knows that a good life is a collection of happy moments shared with family and friends. Make your moments more memorable with products that are wholesome and delicious, naturally. Hunger Root is here. I'm gonna open the box, and my refrigerator is packed. You're watching Domingo Live. And life is messy. I mean, life is not perfect. Everybody's got shit they're going through. Everybody's got stuff they're challenged with. The man you saw in that video right there is from Corpus Christi, and he is the founder of the Blue Cure Foundation Men's Health Month campaign. He's also the founder of the Blue Cure overall, and his name is Gabe, Cama Gabe Canales. Gabe Canales is with us right now to talk about why he created this foundation. Welcome. Yeah. Good to have you. Hey, thanks yeah. for having me. Thank I appreciate it. It's a pleasure to be with you. We have a chronic disease epidemic in this country, and having a segment like this brings attention to something that gets very little attention, and that is men are dying prematurely, and it doesn't have to be this way. On average, men die six years before women, and you've got a lot of dads, husbands, brothers, and sons that aren't getting their checkups. In fact, since COVID, more than half of men aren't getting their checkups, but it's disproportionately higher among Hispanic and black men. And this is so meaningful and this is so personal to me because I've lived with early stage prostate cancer since 2010 when I was diagnosed at age 35. I had no symptoms, no family history, but it was a chance checkup, just a chance checkup. I hadn't had a checkup in over a decade, but that chance checkup informed me that I was 40 pounds heavier than I am today. So I had high body fat percentage. I had a high LDL cholesterol. My blood pressure was high. I was going through anxiety that I wasn't managing correctly and so eventually um, my doctor encouraged me to go to a urologist because I had a high PSA. Okay. Most 35 year old men don't have a PSA test, but that led me to go to a urologist. They confirmed I had slightly low uh, testosterone and a high PSA, and I had a biopsy and a prostate cancer diagnosis. And what we're talking about here, when you talk about PSAs, that's prostate specific antigen, yeah. when you get that blood test, it's part of an overall blood test that yeah. you can ask your doctor to do. That lets you know whether your numbers are high or low. If they move over a certain percentage, yeah. that means that you might have cancer. You might have prostate cancer. Mm -hmm. But what my main purpose in, in, uh, through Men's Health Month is to encourage men to get their checkups discuss cancer screenings with their physician and know your numbers. So what does that mean, know your numbers? All men should know their blood pressure, their blood cholesterol, their blood sugar, their BMI or their body fat percentage. 
That fifth number is a PSA, okay? But discuss that with your physician. Those four numbers, if you know what your LDL is, if you know what your blood sugar, your blood, you will know if you're at higher risk of diabetes, heart disease, stroke. Those are leading killers of men. In fact, the number one killer of, of men is heart disease. It kills 11 times more men every year than prostate cancer. But here's the hope. 80 to 90% of those deaths are preventable. How? Diet and lifestyle. That's empowering because that's according to the CDC and the number one heart hospital in America, the Cleveland Clinic. So, you know, what does that look like? Eat a lot more vegetables, a lot more high fiber, nutrient rich foods, vegetables, fruits, nuts, seeds, legumes, exercise more a little bit every day. Uh, so move a little bit more, manage stress and get adequate, adequate sleep. Those lifestyle habits are transformative. It can lead us to better health sure. and better mental health. And, ma and make the most important decision of your life and actually go to the, your doctor and get a checkup. And and we, uh, you know, me included, being a wife, whether you're your sister, your mom, your grandma, it's our, it's our responsibility to get our men yeah, to go to the doctor. You have to be on them until they do that. Sure. Now we saw on the screen that you've traveled all over and you're actually in the middle of a Men's Health Month tour as we speak. Yeah. Why was it important for you to come to Corpus Christi? I was born here. My family, uh, my parents, my grandparents grew up here. I have a lot of family that live here, and it's there's very low awareness among Hispanic men, which Corpus has a majority of Hispanic men uh, or Hispanic. Um, I want to bring attention to the uh, health disparities that exist among the Hispanic community. Um, I want to chip away at the barriers and the stigma, especially when it comes to mental health. Our lifestyle habits are a um, play a huge role in our mental health. And there is a lot of depression and anxiety that Hispanic men experience. 80% of all suicides are men. So the more that we discuss these issues, the more that stigma gets chipped away. Men can confront these issues. There's no shame. I've experienced anxiety and depression in my life. I've had people in my life that have unfortunately died by suicide. But we have to talk about these issues. We have to get our checkups. And we have to get our cancer screenings. That's why it's important for me to be in Corpus. This is not the last time I'll be in Corpus. I'll be in here in the fall with some upcoming events that we'll be announcing soon, so I'm excited about that. And you've written a book. I've written a book. It's called Unexpected Diagnosis, Prostate Cancer and the Wake-Up Call to Live Healthier and Happier. You can get it at Barnes & Noble or Amazon.com. It shares my journey and the experiences that uh, I believe will help others. One other thing, if you go to our Facebook page, uh, facebook.com forward slash blue cure we will have on there today for those that are uninsured uh, in, in in the community here we're gonna have local resources available so that individuals can get screenings at a on a sliding scale sliding fee scale or for free that is a deal yes. right there and that's the information go to bluecure.org bluecure.org our Facebook page is facebook.com forward slash blue cure and you can also find me on Instagram at Gabe Canales. Every single day I post health tips on prevention and screenings, Very good. all that. Good and stuff. just like you read on the screen, it starts with a lifestyle. Yeah, Very does. important. Absolutely. Gabe, thank you so thank much. You so thank much. you so much. It's a pleasure. Thank you for, for coming by. being here. Thank you. Estás en tu casa, okay? Thank you. Very good. We'll be right back with more Domingo Live after this. If you've been hit by a car or truck, it's important that you call an attorney right away. The passage of time is not your friend. Evidence disappears, witnesses' memories fade, things change. For example, what color is my suit and tie? What color is my pocket square? How about my shirt? Don't wait. Call Herman and Herman Injury Attorneys. We always put you first. This is where the Moreland Shutter story started over 50 years ago, here in Corpus Christi. It continues today with shutters made from American hardwoods that provide unmatched quality accented by rich finishes or luxurious stains. A lifetime warranty has allowed us to have the opportunity to be working with third generation clients. Add style and character to your living space with beautiful shutters. Made here in Corpus Christi at Moreland Shutters. Give us a call for your in-home consultation. I never want my busy lifestyle to get in the way of us eating well. I know a lot of people can relate. At Hunger Root, we do the work for you. That's why we offer healthy groceries and simple recipes to help you feel your best. Seniors 
seniors are overpaying for life insurance, sometimes more than twice the monthly rate of what they could be paying. If you've bought a guaranteed acceptance plan, please pay close attention. A 60-year-old male pays almost $90 a month for less than $11,000 in coverage with a guaranteed acceptance plan. But Senior Life Insurance Company qualified him for $11,000 in whole life protection for less than $48 a month. That cut his monthly life insurance rate in half and saved him over $500 a year. A 75-year-old female could save over $50 a month for more coverage by switching to Senior Life. That's a savings of over $600 a year. Call Senior Life now to compare your current policy and see how we could save you hundreds of dollars a year on your life insurance. We might even be able to help you get money back on your current overpriced policy. Stop overpaying for your life insurance. Call Senior Life Insurance Company now for your free quote. Is your credit score getting in the way of things you want to do? Personal loans through NetCredit help you borrow up to $10,000. So check your eligibility on netcredit.com today without affecting your credit score. You may even be able to build your credit history as you repay. NetCredit, a more personal, personal loan. Welcome back to Domingo Live. Muchísimas gracias por estar con nosotros. It is time to talk about our culture, nuestra cultura, mm -hmm. and food. Two things that we love, oh, right? Good. What a At great combination. My combination. La Cultura Hispánica International Dinner is just around the corner. Mm -hmm. And we have two lovely ladies with us today, Melissa Castro and also Adriana. Adriana, your last name. Adriana y Polita Lamont. Andale, there you go. <laughs> I know. They try to tell me in my ear, and it, they just, it just went so fast. Okay. It's so good to have you ladies here with us this morning, and we're looking forward to this event. Tell us about it. Sí, muchísimas gracias por la invitación. I Agradezco enormemente. Creo yo que una una comunidad unida, es una comunidad que avanza y dentro del Instituto de Cultura Hispánica de Corpus Christi mm -hmm. queremos uh, fomentar y preservar nuestra cultura y estar orgullosos, ¿verdad? Traer uh, eh, este orgullo a nuestra comunidad. Es por eso que vamos a hacer una exposición de diferentes platillos latinoamericanos. Eh, eh, lo que es Venezuela, Cuba, eh, Puerto Rico, eh, México, por supuesto. Sí. Vamos a tener esta, esta cena internacional en donde vamos a tener también las vendedores locales pro, eh, que tienen productos de, de consumo latinoamericano. Así también vamos a tener una exposición eh, de flamenco. Uh, Va a estar yeah. muy, muy padre. Oh, yeah. Va a ser una, una serie de sorpresas y de igual manera, si la gente quiere participar, tenemos boletos todavía a la venta. Todo lo que hacemos dentro del Instituto de Cultura Hispana de Corpus Christi es eh, pro para las nuevas generaciones. Eh, nosotros creamos, eh, bueno, tratamos de acumular eh, diferentes fondos para becas de primera y segunda generación de estudiantes, tanto de preparatoria como de universidad. Es muy importante que la gente sepa en nuestra comunidad que hay representantes, o sea, hay de todo aquí. Sí. Y muchas veces los que se vienen y, 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 y viven aquí de Corpus Christi, que no son de aquí, están buscando a su gente, están buscando Así a alguien es. que estar y es el perfecta, eh, perfecta evento para que puedan ir y para, para que puedan conocer a la gente que tenemos sí. aquí en la comunidad. Melissa, you're one of the event organizers, obviously. You've uh, taken care of this event for some time. Now, is this the first time since pandemic that we do this? No, actually with the Instituto, this is, uh, they do various events mm -hmm. um, that they host throughout the year, so this is just one of the events that they're that they're holding this year, but we also have a golf tournament, golf tournament. and uh, various mixers, mm -hmm. and just trying to promote the, the culture, um, especially with the youth. Yes. You know, we have some new members that we've added that are in their 20s and their 30s, um, that their grandfathers were actually ones that established the whole uh, Instituto, and so that to have that passion to be able to continue um, you know being prideful of where we come yeah. from and not only from you know being Mexico but every culture every every uh, every country every every state is represented I remember that this event started there at Heritage Park in La Casita you know and yes it's been years ago but yes. that's that's how much it's grown ha crecido mucho y queremos que crezca sí. uh, más ¿verdad? entonces ¿dónde va a ser el evento? Eh, va a ser en la iglesia San Pires, uh -huh. aquí en Golija uh -huh. el día eh, 23 de junio eh, a las 6 de 6 a 8 vamos a también a tener una exhibición todo eso también es en base a donaciones sí. vamos a tener una exhibición de carros antiguos sí. eh, de la antigua Habana sí. afuera este, y bueno los tickets para los miembros son 30 dólares eh, para los no miembros 45 dólares y para ustedes traemos sí. un regalito gracias oh, aquí está oh, that's so nice. nuestra, nuestra invitación gracias por el apoyar gracias. 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 esta es tu mesa Melissa 
¿Quieres juntarme contigo, Melissa? Ah, okay. yeah. we, we can do that. Thank you. We can do that. Thank you so much. Yes. Uh, you know, we, 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 of course, don't ask for anything when you come on. No. It's our pleasure no, 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 to no, have no. you on. This is what the show is all about. Exactly. It's the community's platform. Yes. No, y agradecemos you know. mucho que líderes comunitarios como ustedes apoyen este tipo de eventos porque es la única forma que crecemos como comunidad. Sí. Una y si nos gusta comer, Adriana. Si nos gusta comer. Al mismo tiempo. Pero muchísimo. Así es que, sí. Ya. Toda la, la comida es auténtica, o sí. sea, sí. es diferente, ¿no? es, va, va a ser algo totalmente diferente que puede conocer la gente. Y al a mismo ver. tiempo conocer la gente, como dice, sí, y sus claro. seres queridos también nos puede sí. traer, claro. que conozcan también las personas. Sí. Es un evento sí. totalmente familiar, este, no vamos a permitir el alcohol este, en el evento, es básicamente convivencia, este, probar los sabores, la... Este, este sabor, este sazón sí, de nuestra cultura. De nuestra cultura. Ah, de la sazón. Porque hay diferentes diferente sazón, las, pero hay sazón. Hay sí. sazón. Hay sazón. <risa> <risa> Una vez más, los datos de la información que tenemos que pasar. Claro que sí, este, se pueden comunicar. El Instituto de Cultura Hispánica de Corpus Christi está atrás de lo que es el American Band Center. En el, eh, tenemos el día 23 de junio, en punto de las 6 de la tarde, en la, en la iglesia St. Pires. Eh, vamos a tener esta, esta cena internacional y esperamos que todo Corpus Christi sí. nos apoye. Claro que sí. Muchísimas gracias por estar aquí con nosotros. Gracias, gracias. Como siempre. Thank you. Thank Gracias. You so much. We Gracias. You. All right. Once again, más música. Michael Salgado con Mariachi. Mariachi Celestial, right here on Domingo Live. atardecer me iré de aquí me iré sin ti me alejaré de ti con un dolor dentro de mí te juro corazón que no es falta de amor pero es mejor así Comprenderás que lo hice por tu bien, que todo fue por ti. La barca en que me iré lleva una cruz de olvido, lleva una cruz de amor y en esa cruz sin ti me moriré de hastío. Una cruz de olvido Lleva una cruz de amor Y en esa cruz sin ti Me moriré de hastío Que por mí puedan llorar. Mejor será partir, prefiero así que hacerte mal. Yo sé que sufriré, mi nave cruzará. Adiós, adiós, mi amor, recuerda que te amé, que siempre te de amar. La barca en que me iré, lleva una cruz de olvido, lleva una cruz de amor, y en esa cruz sin ti me moriré. Lleva 
una cruz de olvido Lleva una cruz de amor En esa cruz sin ti Me moriré de hastío That doesn't look good. I know what to do. I'm going to castnetusa.com. I can apply minutes, and if approved, I can have the money as soon as the same business day. Go to castnetusa.com to apply for the money you need. Sound. Guitars and amps. Sound. Drums and keyboards. Sound, Sound systems. Sound. Lighting equipment. DJ and recording gear, in-house repair service, lady way and financing, gift cards, open Sundays. The city of Corpus Christi invites you to raise your glass. To ensure fresh, clean water can flow for generations to come, we've secured four water sources for our growing city. But we can't do this alone. We need you. Through limited outdoor watering, smart landscaping, and modernized plumbing, you'll be able to raise your glass with confidence. And we can all drink to that. For over 27 years, Cars for Cash has specialized in selling inexpensive cars the right way in the Coastal Bend. Come by today and see our huge inventory of cars, trucks, and SUVs. Whether you have good credit, bad credit, or no credit, no problem. Your job is your credit. You buy here, you pay here. We specialize in selling pre-owned vehicles under $10,000. Visit Cars for Cash today at 850 SPID and let us help you find that affordable payment you've been looking for. Call or visit us online at carsforcashtx.com. If you love dogs like I do, you'll understand the importance of caring for our furry family members. But sadly, though, so many dogs are waiting to be adopted from pet rescue organizations. I'm John O'Hurley, and I'm asking you to donate $11 a month to the Puppy Food Bank. Your $11 donation will allow them to provide pet food to Corpus Christi Rescue Shelter. So please donate $11 today at puppyfoodbank.org, and I'll send you this special gift as well. Thomas J. Henry is a proud supporter of the Puppy Food Bank. Hungry Root is here. I'm going to open the box. And my refrigerator is packed. This is another Hurricane Preparedness Reminder, sponsored by Evans Glass Service. Garage doors can be a weakness. Even in otherwise sturdy homes, this is a spot where winds can easily enter and cause structural damage. So reinforce garage doors. Welcome back. When was the last time you went fishing? When was the last time you went out to the beach or simply took a drive along Ocean Drive to enjoy the sights of our great Gulf Coast? You know, it's there every day, but sometimes we forget about what lives out there, what is home, and why it is that it's so important to not just those areas of interest that I just mentioned, but to our economy and to our future. There's an event that's coming up uh, called World Oceans Day. And it's a day that we focus on the reality and the importance of our oceans. And here to talk about that event, that particular day, is Megan Radke. She's with the Heart Research Institute uh, for the Gulf of Mexico Studies. And she's gonna talk to us about celebrating World Oceans Day. Tell us a little bit about that event. Yeah, absolutely. So thank you so much for having me. Good to have you. Um, I'm, I, as you said, I'm with Heart Research Institute. And so, you know, everything that we do is, is focused on the Gulf and, you know, creating science-driven solutions for the greater Gulf. And so um, we are so excited to be celebrating World Oceans Day through our second annual Sea to Screen Film Festival. And so we really hope that, you know, through those films, um, people can kind of 
kind of latch on to the message of World Oceans Day and, and find something that inspires them and you know makes them want to um, become a little bit more active in the conservation of you know not just our coast coastline that's here in the Gulf of Mexico but um, just the ocean and marine ecosystems all over the world. Tell us about some of these films. Are these films that were produced locally? So we have some. Um, we'll have several different films, and they're all short films. So they'll be shown in two different flights. Um, they'll start at 6 p.m. on June 7th um, at Alamo Draft House. Okay. Um, and so some are produced locally, and they're produced actually um, by our team at the Heart Research Institute. And so we'll focus on things from, you know, what we do at HRI to oyster conservation and restoration, um, as well as we've got films from Australia, from Africa, um, that are focused more on, you know, marine habitats such as coral reefs, um, as well as, you know, fisheries. So fisheries habitats and the people around the world you know be it the United States or you know in different countries that are focused on really sustaining those resources and um, making sure that they're here not not just for us now but for the next generation there are some folks who may not know specifically what uh, the Heart Research Institute does uh, they all think it's all part of Texas A&M University Corpus sure, Christi, yeah. and it is in some way, it right? It is, mm -hmm. yeah, what do you guys absolutely. Do? So we, we are part of Texas A&M University Corpus Christi, um, but we have several different research fields that we focus on. And so while yes, we do um, have you know more of the traditional marine science focuses, we have a center for sport fish science and conservation. We've got a group that's focused on coastal conservation and restoration, um, and you know of course we've got groups that deal with water quality and ocean acidification. But we also have groups, and this is what makes um, HRI very unique, is that we also have groups that focus a lot on socioeconomics and focus on communities throughout the Gulf and how to make those communities more resilient. So, you know, that's, that's everything from how to recover from hurricanes, how to deal with sea level rise, to also, you know, taking advantage of Gulf resources, our natural resources, but in a sustainable way. Two quick questions here. What do you want folks to walk away from when they see these films? I want people to be inspired and I want them to recognize, you know, how important of a resource and how treasured of a resource that our oceans and our coastal and marine ecosystems are. And I hope that, you know, they'll go out and they'll find a way that they can get involved and whether that's, you know, just going to a local conservation organization like the Texas State Aquarium or getting more involved in a volunteer day that might be happening at um, Oso Bay Wetlands Preserve, something like that, and just taking part. Absolutely. Yeah, just I want them to be inspired and, and recognize how important our oceans are. Once again, this is happening on World Oceans Day. Tell us about the event happening and what time, when and where. Yes, so Sea to Screen Film Festival, June 7th um, at Alamo Draft House here in Corpus Christi. Um, doors will open at 5.30, films will start at 6. Um, there will be a 20 minute intermission right in between the films and people can visit with us from HRI and they can also visit with local conservation organizations. Price of the ticket? $5, you can get tickets on Alamo Draft House website. Can't beat that at all. All right, Megan. Uh, Radke, thank you so much from the Heart Institute, the Research Institute of Corpus Christi. Thank you so much for being Absolutely. with us. Absolutely. Thank you. It. I appreciate right. it. Very good. Now, Michael Salgado, right here on Domingo Live. <laughs>
What should we do? I'm going to CashNetUSA.com. I can apply in minutes, and if approved, we can have the money as soon as the same business day. Go to CashNetUSA.com to apply for the money you need. Would you like a rewarding career in teaching? A career in teaching is an educator preparation program that can help you become a teacher. We have been certifying teachers across the state of Texas since 2004 who have a four-year bachelor's degree. A career in teaching will guide you through the coursework and local training required for a future teacher to successfully transition into today's classrooms. We also provide field supervision during your certification paid internship. A career in teaching. We help teachers create lifelong learners. Seniors are overpaying for life insurance, sometimes more than twice the monthly rate of what they could be paying. If you've bought a guaranteed acceptance plan, please pay close attention. A 60-year-old male pays almost $90 a month for less than $11,000 in coverage with a guaranteed acceptance plan. But Senior Life Insurance Company qualified him for $11,000 in whole life protection for less than $48 a month. That cut his monthly life insurance rate in half and saved him him over $500 a year. A 75-year-old female could save over $50 a month for more coverage by switching to Senior Life. That's a savings of over $600 a year. Call Senior Life now to compare your current policy and see how we could save you hundreds of dollars a year on your life insurance. We might even be able to help you get money back on your current overpriced policy. Stop overpaying for your life insurance. Call Senior Life Insurance Company now for your free quote. Hi, Corpus Christi viewers. I'm Jeff Davis. Our courthouse isn't just a beautiful historic building. It's a place where wrongs are made right, where your rights are protected. With over 25 years experience, the expert legal team at Davis Law Firm fights for Texans every day. We recently won a jury verdict in excess of $9.6 million for leg injuries caused to two cyclists by the driver of an 18-wheeler. So if you've been in a car truck wreck, call me at 444. Oh, come on. I have to do this again? But everyone knows this number by now. There's only one number to remember. Four. Hungry Root is here. I'm gonna open the box and my refrigerator is packed. You're watching Domingo Live. Welcome back to Domingo Live. Good to have you with us. Hoy por la mañana. Saludos a todos nuestros amigos que nos están viendo a través del país. Uh, via Watch Live, Domingo Live, KTRIPLITV.com. 
Uh, saludos también para todos nuestros amigos que nos están viendo aquí en The Coastal Band. That's right. Bienvenidos. Muchísimas gracias por estar con nosotros. En este segmento, we've got our guest, our musical guest, Michael Sagrado and company. That's right. Uh, toda la familia aquí con ustedes. Es todo. Good to have you, brother. Thank you, guys. Thank you guys for having us again. It's been a little while, and it's we're glad to be back. And, When uh, was the last time you were on the show? It was years ago, ¿verdad? Right? I, I think I, I barely remember what I did last week. So. <laughs> don't, don't ask Good that. answer. That's right. a tough question. <laughs> tough question. You, you've got a tour. It's called en vivo tour 2023. That's right. Bueno, pues we've been we kind of already gotten started with that, verdad? Uh, todo todo este año and so we've got a lot of shows coming up this year. You know, we're going to be in Vegas July 7th for the Tejano takeover out there. We're going to be doing uh, the Midwest here in a couple of weeks like Lansing, Michigan, Detroit, Michigan, St. Louis, Missouri. Um, we've got some other dates lined up here in Texas as well that we've got, uh, I think we've got, uh, I think it's a Pina, I think it's Pina County Fair. I'm not sure if it's, if I'm saying it correct. Right? Pima County. Mm -hmm. And uh, so we've got that show coming up. A lot of other shows California. that are coming up. We're going to be in California on the 23rd in uh, Cutler, California. Okay. Then we're going to be in Newark, California. Okay. And so I uh, want to invite everybody to come and join us out there. So we've got, you know, kind of spread out everywhere. Sure. And uh, so, you know, we're pretty glad about being on the road. Sure, and, nobody. And, and you're planning a very, very special trip, and if you've been wanting to take a cruise for a while, oh, you have yeah. a cruise coming up the Tell first week that. of January. How does she know about that? Right. <laughs> <laughs> so so yeah, January 21st, that week. right? January 21st, I mean, January from the 7th through the 13th, right? Okay. We're going to be on, on, on the... Uh, Uh, the Hano Cruise, and I've been posting that on all my social media, so you know I'll be I'll be putting that up where people know where to go, sure. and I, I think it's the Hano's in Paradise. Um, dot com, I think is is the cruise, right? Yeah. The Hano's in Paradise cruise. So we're going to be on that from the 7th through the 13th of January 2024. So make your plans. It's going to be some party, like I tell people every now and then, right? <laughs> so you guys got to be out. It's going to be a lot of a lot of artists out there, a lot of bands. And of course, a lot of good time. Que bien, que bien. And this is all part of the uh, the En Vivo tour that you guys have going. Así es. You're going to be all over the country. I know that in California, you got a massive following. That's that's where we started uh, the radio show back with the nice. Hello Countdown. And that's where we interviewed Michael for the very first time uh, way right. back when, 1986, yeah. I think, something like that. Wow. Um, big following in the Central Valley, especialmente because there's so many Tejanos, displaced yeah. Tejanos that live there that now have made California their right. home. Mm -hmm. But you're going to be all over the country. Yeah, we, we've got some other shows here in, in, uh, in Texas, like we're going to be in Midland. Um, it's, it's coming up, yeah, this Saturday, and then Sunday we'll be in Round Rock. Uh, you know, I'm trying to remember the dates here. It's just kind of, kind of tough. What we got? We've got Floresville, a big July festival 1st. out there, July 1st, and so um, uh, we've got some other dates in July. We're going to be in Abilene, Texas. We're going to be in Stanton, Texas, for kind of our you know hometown area. Mm -hmm. We're going to be doing the Jamaica there. So we hope people come out and, and check us okay. out. It's kind of where we started, you know. Sure. It's our it's our, our backyard. And so we, we're glad to be going back there, small sure. little town. And uh, we've got some other dates in July following that also. Vegas. August, you know, so yeah, of course, Vegas. So just be looking up. We're going to be posting up. You know, of course, I do my videos every week on Instagram. I'm under official Michael Salgado. Remember, it's official Michael Salgado. I've got a lot of hackers out there oh, so you know, make sure to i got one page people ask me every week like uh do, you know you got a new page out no it's the same page you know report the other ones uh, even on tiktok you know i'm under tiktok i've got uh also what's the other one uh, snapchat under el surdo michael mm -hmm. and so uh pretty much everywhere you know the website michaelsalado.com for the dates for merchandise check out all our latest And, um, you know, I keep everybody up to date there every week. Sure. No, I know that you mentioned earlier uh, Stanton and then and you're kind of remembering how you started. Share with our audience how Michael Salgado got started. Well, you know, we, we got, uh, we, our background is kind of from the country, farming. My dad is kind of where he got started, Eddie Neo Salgado, you know, my mom out there. And so, uh, you know, we grew up in Los Ranchos and, and my dad was, he was a mu musician, you know, back in the day. and. You know, I remember watching him, and then, you know, he got he got away from the, the music, but he always had that music in him. He always had a guitar at home, so you know that's how we got started. And throughout the years, he, he decided to do a band, 
And so I got in with him. He was playing accordion at the time. I started on the bass. And, you know, Ernie at that time, so he was kind of getting into it, playing the cowboy and whatever, right? Sure. And that's how we got started. <laughs> and I think me and him tried out also messing around with the drums, but yeah. drums wasn't sure. for me. I mean, I played, I think, bass. I played some bajo, you know, guitar and sure. keyboard, different things like that. So throughout the years, we kind of found our place, right? I mean, I, I, I always kind of did lead vocals. My dad did segunda. So then, I, you know, I kind of experimented. I think I kind of wanted to learn a little bit of the bajo, but then I went to the accordion. You know, because one of my biggest influences, I think everybody knows, is uh, Don Ramon Ayala, right? So, yeah. you know, I was like, well, I want to be an accordion guy too. And, you know, so I went from bass to accordion. Then my dad just kind of sang uh, backups. And then Ernie, I think, went to the bass from there. Yeah. And then from there, we kind of, you know, and then as time passed, and he went to the bajo sexto. Sure. And so, yeah. you know, at the time, we had Joe and Padre Scanze on the bass and uh, my compadre Jaime. You know, it's, it's, so as time passed, you know, some changes went on going. So now, you know, got my son-in-law Edward on the bass, mm -hmm. and we got little Chris now that's on the drums. Yes. But, you know, it, we kind of started, <laughs> yeah, we kind of started in the, in the farm. You know, we drove John Deere tractors. We worked the fields. Uh, a lot of people don't know that about us, but, you know, we sold vegetables door to door. We we cut grass, you know, we, if we, my dad could do it, we did it, you know what I mean? It's like, we, <laughs> we fixed lawnmowers. I mean, we did it all, you know, my dad didn't have us sitting at home. And so we learned how to, you know, survive in life. And, and uh, so when we went to music, I told my brother, well, thank God we're gonna play now. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this is good, you got to good grass. Right. And, but you know, it taught us to survive and, and, and yeah. sometimes it's what you need, you know? Yeah, absolutely. Something that I've been hearing throughout the whole time that you've been talking is family. And it's very important to Definitely. Michael Salgado. It's very important to, of course, Ernie and the guys. And on the road, it's family. Yeah, I mean, the I got, my, I got my, my son, Michael Jr., and my daughter, Katrina, that work on the road, you know. And so, you know, it's, it's kind of important. And, you know, you have people that, you know, that you can trust. I mean, this business is tough. So, you know, you got I, I like having a family. And you got my brother with me since the beginning. Yeah. So, you know, it, it, it works out. And, and, you know, my dad comes every now and then. And hangs out my mom while well, we kind of stay connected sure. with her as well because you know she's she, she's done great throughout the years absolutely bringing us up and you know being there for us and my dad too so he's always been a big supporter and all the family my sister you know who's kind of in the back you know but yeah. but my sister elizabeth she's always been there and and so it's great you know to be able to to have that that family around you while we're we That's do what we love because this you know we're living the dream and if you can wake up every day and do what you love, you know that you're that much ahead. Yeah, you're not, and you're not really working. Yeah, that's right. right. When yeah. we come back, we're going to take a, uh, take a look at the uh, fruits of their labor through a video that, that Michael and everybody's produced, and we want to share that with you when we come back. We're here on the Mingo Live. Stick around. Yeah, dude, that doesn't look good. I know what to do. I'm going to castnetusa.com. I can apply minutes, and if approved, I can have the money as soon as the same business day. Go to castnetusa.com to apply for the money you need. How do we earn award after award? By treating every case like it's our only case. firm you trust. Hi, I'm Ashlyn Pro. For over 60 years, ProOptical has been committed to improving how you see the world. ProOptical offers the best value, quality, and service in the industry. For three generations, our family continues to provide service that proves your eyes are in our best interest. Advanced equipment, the largest selection of designer frames, sunglasses, and contact lenses. Siegel Vision Glasses 49, Bifocal 59. And remember, CS Pro as professional. Hunger Root is here. And I needed it because my fridge is super empty. I'm gonna open the box. That's the exciting part. Hungry Root came through. And my refrigerator is packed.
Is your Generac home standby generator ready for a power emergency? Are you overdue for annual maintenance? Schedule a multi-point inspection today with Generator Supercenter. Factory certified technicians are standing by to ensure your Generac generator is ready when you need it most. Call today. Familias. Las familias necesitan espacio. De aquí al carapulpo es mi lado. Las familias necesitan compartirlo todo. Las familias necesitan... Perdón. Una familia de SUVs para lo que sea que necesite tu familia. Ven a ver la gran equipo de Volkswagen de Corpus Christi. Pase y amor, mis amigos. Welcome back to Domingo Live. This video that Michael produced, uh, totally representing Texas. Yes, este, and, and all and its sharing, glory. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> and sharing it with the rest of the world. The video is for the uh, the music or the song Tormento Ingrato. Um, let, let's share some uh, a co couple of seconds here so you can see it. <laughs> Something out of a Wild Wild West uh, movie. Yeah. <laughs> look, at, look at the setting. So where like, is this at? It's like you went back in time. It is a great place. I mean, you know, you can make probably a no western in that area, right? It's called Enchanted Ranch. Springs. Oh, Enchanted Springs. Enchanted Springs. I'm burning Texas. And you can rent that place. You know, people can rent it and do different things there. But it was a very very like you know it takes you back to that kind of western look so we really love the, the area shooting out there sure how long did it take you guys to do it yeah. we, we did probably most of the day you know it took us most of the day to it actually oh and it rained oh it rained almost yeah yeah it was raining a little bit so i hear it's kind of good luck i guess huh? yeah i mean so, it looks like something out of gun smoke that's right whose yeah. idea was the concept of the video What's that? whose idea was uh, director that director, Mike, Mike Jr. Oh, Mike Jr. <laughs> Mike nice Jr. job. And so, uh, you know, it, it's kind of, you know, we kind of kind of put in there, but uh, definitely it was something different that, you know, kind of, that kind of we've done. And, and so we, we really like the scenery. And, but it's definitely a nice place to rent to kind of, you know, maybe have a party. And it's kind of expensive. But, you know, so. <laughs> No, yeah, it's going to be a special party, but, but, but look at the video pandemic prices. Take it easy, come on. The, the, the quality of the video, the way it looks, the backdrop, I mean, everything looks amazing. And yeah. how much time was spent producing? Yeah, my, my son was shooting a lot of it, Mike Jr., you know. And so, uh, right right so he did, he did, yeah, he saw the rain right there. And so, yeah, he's done most of my videos, you know. And, uh, uh, of course, all the other country stuff too my son has, has shot that as well we kind of do that all in house and so i guess that's about what four or five country videos too but uh, we hope people really enjoy that you know we've gotten a lot of views on it and so but yeah check it out tormento ingrato where do we see it on it's on my uh, uh, on my channel uh, Michael Salgado, so check it out on YouTube. And I know that last night you were in Alice, Texas. How did it go? It was great. You know, crowd was was really you know uh, pumped up out there, and and I think it was wanted to rain out there too. Oh. But yeah. but you know it was good good show. It rained a little bit. Well, we also want to thank uh, Ruben Lopez, Town of Roots, también uh, a Rolly's Barbecue. Yeah, they came out and cooked nice. for us. Yeah, cooked for us. Great, great, oh, you know, so great sweet. barbecue. We really yeah. enjoyed it. You know. That was awesome. Thank yeah, you really it. They, they, they rolled so out the red carpet. Oh my goodness, look at that. Oh, look at that guy. He had too much. Uh, a little bit too <laughs> much. Right? A little bit too much. It's all acting, guys. It's all acting. It's, it's acting. Not it's, it's not real. real. It's not real. It's for Remember fun. Remember you said, Louie, but maybe he was looking funny. All oh, good people. All the guys out there working hard. Sure, absolutely. And Danny come in. Danny, yeah. uh, checking us out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're watching us. Remember, we're working. We're going to watch all. Uh, he said, I don't know how we're going to watch it. <laughs> there you go. No, we're on TV. Before yeah. you had the barbecue, I know that you posted something. You were at Whataburger, and all yeah, the ladies go away and went nuts. Yeah, yeah. I mean, <laughs> it, it was it was uh, nice to see some fans out there and took a picture with the team of Whataburger <sighs> and a couple of uh, sweet uh, ladies out there that also, you know. Yeah. I mean, you got to love the, the elders. Remember, respect your elders. That's and, right. You know, it, it's something very important for, you know, for our young generation to remember, you know, these people have been around and they know a thing or two, you know. And so uh, I've always been, you know, brought up that way, respect your elders and, you know, 
and love them while they're here. That's Absolutely. right. Yeah. Absolutely. You got one more song, right, for us? Yeah. Thank okay. Yeah. All right. We'll be right back with one more song from Michael Salgado next on Domingo Live. Hunger Root is here. I'm going to open the box. And my refrigerator is packed. I was rear-ended by a truck while stopped at a yield sign. I injured my neck and had nerve damage in my back. I was overwhelmed by the situation and didn't know what to do. That's when I called Jeff Davis. Jeff and his team took care of everything and gave me the peace of mind I so desperately needed. We set up the case and I got $350,000. It's really true. When you call the fours, the fours are with you. I'm Jeff Davis, the fours lawyer. Call me at 444-4444. That's 444-4444. That's right. There's only one number to remember, and that's four. Del Mar College salutes our top scholars of South Texas. Congratulations from the KIII TV family of stations and Del Mar College. Your future built here. As homeowners, we need and want convenience. We also want quality. Hi, I'm Bobby Jenkins with ABC. At ABC, we want to be your one-stop home service company. Pest control, check. Air conditioning, check. Anything in the yard, check. All with licensed, background-checked employees. You call one number, have a complete record of all the work performed at your home. Just another reason why ABC should be your home service company. One-stop service from ABC Home and Commercial Services, specialists for your environment. In the morning when I rise, I know I've got you on my side. You're good for me, so naturally. And I can't wait for that fresh taste of richness you bring. I like the way you make me feel. Yeah. Highland Dairy knows that a good life is a collection of happy moments shared with family and friends. Make your moments more memorable with products that are wholesome and delicious, naturally. Is your credit score getting in the way of the things you want to do? Personal loans through NetCredit offer fast and flexible lending. Borrow up to $10,000 and choose repayment terms that work for you. You may even be able to build your credit history as you repay. NetCredit, a more personal, personal loan. Welcome back. Whenever it's mass, queremos despedirnos en este segmento breve. Este, during the week, Barbie and JTK this week? No, JTK is off this week, okay, so it'll be my, me and Michael Espia. Very good, and we'll be back on, of course, at 6 and 10 with me and Leslie and, yeah. and Alan Holt. So we'll see you during the week. Que la pasen muy bien. One more song here with Michael Salgado. Adios. Was the day Give me the other day A good morning kiss A hot cup of coffee You never know The whole world was about to change And then that telephone rang At 8.17 And every day she seemed just fine there was always that thought in the back of her mind. If I'm gone, here's your favorite recipe. If I'm not here, cancel those credit cards and magazines. If I moved on, there are some things you'll need. Some passwords and a mailbox key. And hang that favorite picture of me.
I'm gone, don't let that bottom get the best of you. If I'm not here, call our children. You have been watching Domingo Live, a South Texas tradition since 1964.